In the mythology of ancient Greece, each expression of the various sciences, arts, literature, and music were personified as a muse. It was the job of each muse to inspire and motivate researchers, artists, writers, and other creative minds, including natural philosophers, the forerunners of modern scientists. Now, in our time, an inventive new instrument whose acronym is MUSE for Multi-Unit Spectroscopic Explorer has been fired up for the very first time on the European Southern Observatory's very large telescope at the Paranal Observatory in northern Chile. This MUSE, comprised of nearly seven tons of intricate optics, electronics, and mechanics, will look across time for signatures of galaxy formation in the early universe. But it can also examine planets, moons, and asteroids right here in our own solar system. The MUSE's host telescope, VLT Unit 4, is soon to employ fully adaptive optics, nimbly changing its shape to subtract any optical aberrations from atmospheric currents wafting through the normally stable air above the Chilean mountains. MUSE works by breaking light into its constituent colors. Its 24 spectrographs produce 3D data determining the chemical spectrum of each pixel. Astrophysicists can swim through these data sets, turning their attention to specific frames of reference as they interactively tune in different wavelengths. They can easily see and study the movements of gas, dust, and energy as these map themselves onto the substructure of space-time. With MUSE, astrophysics will begin to look and feel as much like an art form as a science. What will they discover? Watch this space. For Space.com, I'm Dave Brody.